The Keitsi, Kwatlin, and Semiamu nations are renewing a decades-long call to have a piece of federal surplus land returned to them. We ask for the return of a portion of our traditional territory. This request is not about reclaiming the past, but about creating a future where our people can thrive once more. And the land is rightfully ours. The 300-acre land is along 192nd Street in South Surrey. KKS says it's the largest piece of crown land remaining in their shared territories and would support their cultural and economic future. It's a right thing to do and it's time. It's our people's time and we'll shine. We'll make you proud. Hepo Potato Farm leases the land and says it's vital to BC's food security. The elevation and soil means it cannot be replaced, especially for early harvest. About 50% of the potatoes that are produced from May to August come from this field. And a lot of other farmers use this field as um, a backstop. So if it's raining a lot, the orders go to this field so that there can be continuity in the grocery stores. But the nation say suggestions that this land is essential for food security are misleading and ignores indigenous rights. These are not agricultural lands. They are not zoned agricultural lands. They are zoned light industrial. They are zoned employment lands. Um, we continue on regardless of, of what will happen in the future. The, 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 the decision and the conversation today is acquisition of lands. We have interest in every piece of crown land that becomes available to acquire those lands and bring those lands back, whether that's just for us as Simiyama or collectively as Keitsi Kwan and Simiyama. KKS says they would use the land to benefit their nations and the entire region, but do not have any concrete plans right now. Grace Key, Global News.